like a boss. I didn't stage this, I promise. Um, fixing to go over to the in-laws' house to do a little bit more of their work on the electrical, and when we were over there last time, realized it sure would have been nice to have the box plate on the tractor to help fill that ditch in. Well, rather than go over there to get the tractor or get the trailer to come back here to load the box plate, just picked the little puppy up and set it in the back of the truck, and I did it without hitting the truck. Oh, didn't even ding nothing. Just kind of real slow, dude. I didn't have any help for a tag line, so I had to kind of just let it swing around side to side and spin on its own until it finally got in the right position and just set it down between the bedsides real quick before it could spin anymore. And then once it was between the fender walls, obviously it just kind of settled on its own. But yeah. It would have been good to actually get the footage for you guys for entertainment value, but my tripod is somewhere. So you got to take my word for it. You get over to the house, maybe I can get footage. Uh, we'll use the tractor over there to lift it out of the bed of the truck. All right, well, since I didn't get video of putting it in, I'm going to try to get video of taking it out for you. So let me there. Couldn't quite go high enough to get it turned loose, and I was afraid if I tried to lift all the way up, that something wild would happen, and it would like swing over and bash into the back window of my truck. So I figured I had it stable the way it was. Figured I would just roll with that, pull it out from under. And of course, at the house, I set it in with the excavator, um, but it made it a little bit prettier. Anyway, let's get over here to the shop and set down.
sure I'm not leaking any diesel fuel out. This tractor, I don't know if I told you guys or not before, but this tractor will seep diesel fuel out if it's fully, fully, fully full. It's like it's missing a gasket or something in here. So if the tank is completely full and you're parked on a slight downhill, it'll drip out diesel there. But the tank's low enough right now that it's not. But we are on a little bit of a hill. <coughs> All right, so that part's done. Odds are good, probably won't even use the box blade while he's got it here, because he pretty much did all this by hand already. But he's got it, anyway. Um, I think I'm gonna pull my truck in the shop and do an oil change.